Well, g'day everybody and welcome back to Captain of Industry. All right, a couple of things that we need to do here. Uh, where are we? We've got all this stuff being dumped over here. Uh, we can get rid of those tutorials there. There we go. All right, so we've got uh, we've got some production sorted out here. Our plan is to move all of this, uh, build all of this town, city, town, slash everything out in this direction here, which is pretty cool. So, uh, so we are going to do that. Everything seems to be going all right production-wise. Uh, everything's going all right health-wise, although it has dropped down. It has dropped down a little bit. So, uh, interestingly enough, now... We've got our, uh, we've got our, uh, our, we have our, uh, excavator here. What we're going to do is, uh, the first thing that we are going to do is we're going to head out and do some, uh, we're going to head out and do some coal. Now the coal is right through here. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw a mining thing down. Uh, where are we? Mining, mining, mining. Uh, we've got general machines. So we've got an assembly factory, which we can get running as well. Uh, we are going to throw a, uh, where are we? Where are we? No, 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 no. Yes, we're going to do that. Uh, we are going to go flat and we're going to throw an area through here to mine out, as you can see, like that. Uh, probably right through there as well, I think. Uh, we are going to need to throw ourselves a, um, uh, buildings for vehicles, mine control tower. Uh, we're going to need to throw one of those in there. And we're going to need to set the area. So we're going to have to edit that area to all of this here. Which should be good. That will be perfect. We'll assign a truck, uh, one truck, and we will assign an excavator to that. And that's going to start digging out coal. Uh, which is going to be pretty important. So everything should, uh, the trucks should all start heading out there. They should start taking um, equipment and stuff down there as well. Now, uh, research, we're doing power and maintenance at the moment, which is really, really cool. The next thing that I want to do is, uh, because we're going to need to set up, um, uh, we're going to need to set up maintenance and stuff, which is going to be pretty important. Uh, what I do want to do is I want to start putting some storage in. Uh, some unit storage. So I think I may have put these. Uh, I may have put these a little bit too. Yeah, I have. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually grab that. I think you can actually. Can you actually move them? I'm pretty sure you can. You can cut and uh, you can paste them. So we're probably going to do. When enabled, it automatically pauses any new construction. Uh, what we might do is we might cut that. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. Let's cut that and let's paste it, which should be C. No, that's copy. Uh, all right. Well, what I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to actually delete this. I think. Uh, so we will pause it, uh, and we will delete it. I think is probably going to be the the only way to go. So we're going to delete that, and then we are going to uh, let's get rid of layers. Then we're going to actually build ourselves another one. So, uh, but we are going to build it sitting out here instead right lovely and uh, we're going to delete that right there we're going to delete that one and we're going to delete that one as well come on there we go lovely and that one delete this one as well please there we go okay it's deleted it just took a little while to do uh, okay, uh, conveyors, we're going to need to run a molten channel through here to there and connect that up. And that's going to be a little bit better because what that's going to allow us to do as soon as this truck gets out of the way is to put a warehouse in there. We're going to have to do the same over this side. So let's uh, pause that. 
Let's make sure that this is uh, this is running and operating. Yep, it is beautiful. And let's uh, delete this one. So we're going to delete that as well. There we go, lovely. And we're going to throw another one of those down really quickly before. Uh, uh, let's flip it. And we're going to throw it in here, like so, and delete that molten channel there as well. Uh, where are you, bulldozer? There we go. So we'll delete that. And we'll delete that, and then we will. Uh, then we shall run that molten channel. I didn't delete. Come on. Ah oh, no! It's deleted that whole thing. No. Can't cancel it either. Oh no, they're building. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. I got a little bit worried there. Uh, let's go and throw a molten channel into here. Like that. Right, perfect. Perfect. Now the trucks are out of the way, so what we can do now is uh, uh, we can throw in a warehouse or a unit storage and we should be able to connect that to that. And we want to throw another one in here and connect that to that. And I think we will actually double those up as well. Like so. Which will be absolutely perfect. Now they will, uh, they will, if we, uh, if we go into here, product assigned is iron. So that should go straight into there. Product assigned there is iron as well. So that's good. I just thought I'd double those up and stack them because uh, it kind of makes sense to me to have them. Uh, there we go. Lovely. Keep full. Uh, so yeah, we'll just keep that full of those and we'll keep that one full as well. And that one will keep full as well if we can. And that one will keep full. So. I think that's how you do it. I think that's how you do it, but I may not be correct. The next thing that we're going to have to do is we're going to have to have conveyor belts coming out of there. Now, I'm not sure when uh, when conveyor belts will happen. Uh, if we go and have a look in our research, uh, storage, uh, concrete production. Where are conveyor? Conveyor belts are over here in construction too, so we're going to have to get at least these three uh, set up and uh, and ready to go. So, so that is that. That is next. Then we should do uh, probably copper refinement. We'll add that to the queue. Uh, better storage. We'll add that to the queue. We'll do dock repair which we can't do at the moment, and we'll add that one to the queue. And that one has to be added to the queue as well. Before we can do that, beautiful. And we'll see how <laughs> we'll see how that goes. That's quite a bit, but uh, but at this point in time, I think it's probably all right. Power production, uh, we've got maintenance, cargo docks, a trading dock. So we can actually put a trading dock down now. What I might do is put the trading dock over here somewhere, I think there that'll be okay that's not too far from these warehouses and we are bringing our production down through here we've got uh that is happening now so he is uh he is doing coal which is really really good so what i want to do now is probably i think i want to assign a second truck to that um where can I unassign my control tower? Compatible trucks. I would like to assign another truck to that, I think, as well. Um, do we do it through the mining tower? Ah, yes. So we'll, uh, we'll stop that. There we go, we'll add that there, and we've got two trucks assigned there, which is cool. So they can, oop, so he can keep going now, and he's assigned to that mining control tower. I probably should have assigned him to that first. So these two trucks should, uh, should start running coal over to here. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to pause that, 
And I'm actually going to pause that because we don't want that to happen anymore. What we do want to happen, though, is we do need to get some storage up for uh, for some timber. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to throw a... Probably here, maybe. I'm going to throw a couple of unit storages in here. Maybe three. Have we got enough parts? Yeah, I've got enough parts to throw three. Now, these are going to take only wood. That one there is going to take wood and that one there is going to take wood as well all right beautiful so that's where uh, that's where the timber is going to get stored uh, now so we've got our storage from for metal which is actually getting pretty full it's starting to get pretty full anyway uh, which is really really good so the next thing that we need to do now is we need to get a manufacturer in straight away so we go into here and we do an assembly now, that's going to have to take timber and concrete and metal in as well. So what I'm going to do for now is I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to put it in here. I think I might have my... Ma I, I, don't, I don't want my manufacturing too far away from... Uh, uh, too far away from... Uh, from the resources and stuff but I do want them and a concrete mixer as well which is going to require cement slag and water so we'll probably throw a concrete mixer in too uh, right in about there okay so we're running out of construction parts now uh, we're gonna also need to do some uh, some uh, vehicle parts as well uh, Yep, yep, I know that. I'm aware of that. Uh, so this guy here is going to create uh, construction parts only. So we need to get all of that stuff into there, which is perfectly fine. Uh, we will get our concrete and our electronic parts from there. This guy here is going to make uh, vehicle parts and also make... Uh, we'll probably actually just leave it at vehicle parts at the moment, I think, for now. Uh, that is going to need power. So we're going to need to get power to get that running. Uh, now, I'm going to need a, a warehouse and stuff down here as well. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to grab unit storage. And I'm going to hook one up to that. And then I'm going to hook one up to that. That there will take uh, that there will take vehicle parts. And we'll try and keep it full. That one there will take construction parts, and we'll try and keep that full as well. Now that should be okay because we've got uh, yeah we've got vehicle parts getting made there. All right, beautiful. Now the next thing that we need to do is uh, not enough maintenance yet. Yeah, tell me about it. Tell me about it. The maintenance is going to be the next one. Rainwater harvesters would be good. Uh, where is our vehicle maintenance now? Uh, housing and services, buildings for vehicles, depot, maintenance depot, right there. All right, so I'm going to throw the maintenance depot itself just in here, I think. Uh, Probably about there, I think. So that's going to require some electronics and some mechanical parts. Now we do have, uh, we do, we don't have any mechanical parts. So that means that this guy here is going to have to make mechanical parts as well, which is going to take iron. All right, so we should start getting some mechanical parts coming through too, which is going to be pretty important. So. There we go. Lovely, lovely, lovely. What I might do... I don't think that building's costing us any maintenance. But it is going to... We are going to need power and stuff in that as well. How are we going there? We're going there. Let's just keep that full. Let's keep that full as well. And we'll keep that full. Now, I wanted to get... Uh, I wanted to get the... Uh, get the coal mining, the coal excavation up first. Whereabouts is that? Oh, he's gone down to get fuel. Okay. 
Ooh, fuel is going to be a big thing as well. It's going to be the next thing that we're going to need to do. Uh, unit storage, research, uh, buildings, housing, food markets, trading dock, mining designation. Uh, so we're going to have to put, at some point in time, we're going to have to put another mine control over there, mine control tower. But we probably need to look at uh, getting some more food in. And the reason why we need to get more food in is because we're going to need, uh, shortly we are going to need, there we go, we'll throw that in there. Uh, shortly we're going to need uh, more workers because we've only got 15 workers available at the moment. So uh, is that full? Yes, it is. That's full as well. That is full as well. All right, these guys are producing. They should be what are they missing? What input are they missing? Electronics and mechanical parts. Which we don't have any in stock at the moment, do we? Hmm. That is missing input as well. What's that missing? That should be should be getting timber and it should be getting concrete slabs. We are still pulling that apart, aren't we? Yeah, there's still plenty of stuff in there. Okay, so maybe what we need to do then is maybe we need to build ourselves a little uh, a little warehouse, a little unit storage warehouse here somewhere uh, that will. Um, I'll throw that there for now and that we are going to put in concrete slabs and then we're going to build another one and we're going to put in uh, should slot in there actually that's going to be a bit of a problem there isn't it let's build it there for now and that one there is going to take electronics and that is taking vehicle parts uh, that is taking construction parts and we're going to need to do another one to take uh, which we'll do there and that one there is going to take mechanical parts okay so we've got construction parts in there we've got vehicle parts in there all right lovely Lovely. Let's uh, keep that full as well. I'm just going to keep everything full at the moment, I think, or as full as we possibly can. I'm going to throw that up there too. Now, how much diesel do we have left? We've got 691, so that's going to have to be a uh, that's going to have to be a priority at some point as well. Uh, low maintenance, yes, I know. Assembly ready, yep, uh, yep, yep. Low maintenance. <clears throat> Yeah, I know, I know. I'm trying to build the parts for the maintenance depot. Uh, we need one and one of those to do maintenance. So they should be making that. Don't pause it. Let's just get it going. Get it going. Come on, come on. Uh, let's do the... Let's do that as a priority. Let's get that built as a priority. They should be sending stuff over. We've got plenty of mechanical parts and stuff. Okay, everybody's running around. Everybody's doing their stuff. What was that dumping in there, I wonder? Potatoes. Okay, beautiful. Beautiful. I'm looking forward to uh, doing crop rotations and stuff on this as well. All right, let's let these things get built. Now the trading dock is done. I think we've got 15 workers available. So uh, request trucks to prioritize unloading uh, all the cargo stored here. And then we can trade with villagers. So the only village that we know at the moment is that one there. Now they'll take wood for concrete slabs. So I think we might uh, we might grab some of that. Uh, they will also take, uh, or they'll take mechanical parts for copper. Uh, let's trade some of that. 
actually. Let's get yeah, let's get a hundred of those in. That'll be that'll be really really cool. Uh, what's this coal? We don't need to trade, but we could trade our own coal off if they're happy. Yeah, see now we're producing our own coal. We could trade that off for some fuel. Don't have enough products to trade with. Oh, they want forty. Per, okay, and then the rubber. Um, we could get some rubber in probably, and oh, we don't need iron scrap. Okay, uh, the other thing that we can do is we can actually uh, get some population from there as well. Now this is in the process of being constructed, so it's waiting for material delivery, but we do have plenty of construct. We've got 80 construction parts in there, so I'm not sure why. I'm not sure why that's taking a long time to do, but it is. All right, I'm just going to use some points. I'm just going to use some quick delivery points for these because I really need to get that storage done. Uh, so I'm going to spend a little bit of Unity to get these built. I'm definitely going to spend a bit of Unity to, to get this one built as well. Uh, yeah, we definitely need to we definitely need to get those done. So hopefully, uh, hopefully that'll help. Hopefully that'll help. Now uh, we want to keep those. Yep, see mechanical parts are going straight in there now. Electronics are going to come from over here uh, where we've got uh, finished basic diesel. So we can do diesel now. Uh, where we've got 232 electronics and uh, 1286 of those in here. Um, so, ooh. Oh, does this require requires 25 kilowatts of power damn it we're gonna to have to put a, a diesel generator in which is going to generate 216 kilowatts I'm gonna put that over here I'm gonna keep that away from uh, I'm gonna keep that away from town so I might actually put the diesel generator here so they can start building that we're gonna uh, probably what what do they need to build that they need construction parts and electronics I'm just gonna quick deliver that and get that up and running now that's going to need diesel delivered to it I'm guessing requires diesel uh, and produces 216 kilowatts so hopefully we'll get uh, he must be taking uh, concrete parts from there so hopefully we'll get some power running on that then we need to uh, then we need to start considering doing a, an oil refinery and a distillery because we only have 646 fuel left. Now, I don't know why it's saying we've only got six... Cons oh, we do only have six construction parts. Okay, so we might want to... We might want to boost up... We might want to boost the uh, production on that so that we can... Uh, so that we can actually... There we go. We've got enough stuff in there as well. We've got our power running now. Yes, we are generating power. Excellent. So now our maintenance is going to work, which is which is perfect. Happy about that. It says that it's got a missing input. Uh, I'm not sure exactly which input. It's probably electronics, I would say. Uh, electronics? No, we've got plenty of electronics there. We've got plenty of mechanical parts there. And we're still waiting for... That's got 180 store. Oh, no, it's got nothing in it as well. It's got nothing in it yet, so... Lovely. All right, so that's happening. There's obviously a big run between those things. Uh, let's put that up as a construction priority. And we may actually be running out of trucks. I don't know. Are we are we continuing to produce coal? Yeah, we are. Perfect. Uh, I wonder whether to pause this at the moment. What do we got timber-wise? We've got 504. Uh, we have 821 metal plates got 600 concrete at the moment 151 vehicle parts which is good uh, 94 months of food supply so what we are going to do now is we are going to get ourselves another excavator and another two trucks I think so we'll get those built uh, concrete mixer has no recipe selected yet doesn't at the moment uh, well, we can actually do gravel. See, we could do slag crushed, but to do slag crushed, I think we need a crusher. So we're going to need a crusher here. 
So we'll do a crusher down next door to that. And that is going to crush slag. That's going to be the recipe. So they'll bring slag over from here. Because I think this does produce slag, doesn't it? Is it that one that produces slag? Is it that that produces slag? I can't remember. One of them does. Uh, and then we are going to do crushed slag and water for that. Right, beautiful. Speaking of water, we do now need to get some uh, get some water happening. So what we're going to do with that is we are going to build some rainwater harvesters. We're going to throw one there and one there. Oh, and one there. All right, so there's some rainwater harvesters. Beautiful. Uh, so that should keep that going. These here, we can probably shut these down now, you know, to be honest. Now that we're, now that we're digging our own coal, I might actually delete those and get the resources back. So I'm going to delete that. I'm going to delete that there. And then they'll get those, we'll get those resources back because at the moment I don't think we need them at the moment. So, how's our diesel going? Uh, 636. Get rid of those. And then we'll get rid of that and we'll get rid of that as well. And we'll get those parts for that. Did I miss doing that one? I may have done. I may have done. Nope. Didn't miss getting that one. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. I think uh, I think at this point we're we're not too bad. We need to get that iron ore happening, and we're going to start to need to get copper and stuff happening as well. Uh, what are we doing on the uh, on the research at the moment? We're doing copper refinement at the moment. Uh, then it's going to move to storage. Then it's going to move to synthetic rubber, beacon, and ship dock repair. And then we should be able to start getting towards doing conveyor belts once we've got all that stuff unlocked. So that should be pretty cool. See, so crop rotation is down there. I didn't. I don't think I showed you how big this, uh, how big this um, tech tree is. Look at it. Look how huge it is. It's massive. It is massive. But uh, we are only here at the moment. So, but working very well. It's all working very well. Uh, he health and pollution. Uh, let's see, population, base, health, pollution. You can increase your population health by providing a variety of food, water, and health care. Uh, if we admit pollution. Now, if we have a look on here, then we should get an overview of, uh, so they're getting food, which is really, really good. Uh, we've got 93 months worth of food there. General, we've got, uh, no electricity. We don't have electricity. Why don't we have electricity? I thought that we did. We've got food. We don't have hospitals. Open population overview. Uh, research lab times two minus 0. 0.5. Air pollution minus one. Hmm. Okay, but our health is, is plus po uh, 0. 0.09. So percent. So I'm hoping that that goes up a little bit. I'm hoping that it goes up a little bit. I have no idea why uh, why construction has stopped, to be honest. I don't know why construction has stopped. And what are these guys doing? Uh, they've got coal. But there's no valid destination. This is the problem that I've had a few times. I don't know whether these... Can these, can these guys take coal? Can these warehouses take coal? I think maybe what we'll do is uh, maybe put in a couple of warehouses here. Uh, actually, they're probably better off being down here, aren't they? So maybe... Maybe we'll put uh, some storage down here for coal. Uh, what are the inputs on that? And throw one there and I'm going to throw one here as well and I'm going to set those up for coal. 
They don't take coal. Okay. Let's uh, cancel that construction and cancel that construction. Uh, fluid storage. We're gonna need. Uh, we're gonna need to have fluid storage. We're gonna need some of that out here. Uh, we could probably throw that in there. Actually, uh, actually, if we throw it in the middle, like that, and throw some pipes in as well. Where are our pipes? Right there. So if we go from there to there. We go from there to there and there to there. Why is it doing it that way? No, 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 no. To there, I guess. That seems to be the way to go. Okay, beautiful. So that'll give us uh, input for water storage there. And then if we set that to store water... That will be perfect. Lovely. And we're going to have to store wastewater as well. So these are getting built. They're just getting built very, very slowly. So I think maybe another water tank would be a good thing to do. And if we get that up and running and that stores water as well. Lovely. Now we're going to have to think about wastewater at some point in time as well. So... But there you go, guys. I am going to leave this episode here. I don't know why these guys are no valid destination. I'm guessing that uh, I'm guessing that this storage is full. Yes, it is. Okay, that is full. So we're going to have to keep our eye on wood. Uh, these trucks are going to be idle. So what I'm guessing, what I'm thinking, is maybe removing one of those trucks from there. And I'm thinking of removing one of those that are assigned to him as well. And that way uh, that way we'll have uh, more vehicles set up. I'm looking forward to getting to, towards conveyors because, uh, because that'll actually prevent us from running heaps and heaps of vehicles. And we are starting to run low on diesel. So anyway, that will be in the next episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit like and share this around. I'll see you next time. Bye.